Johann Jakob von Leers, later known as Omar Amin, was born on January 25, 1902, in V. et Lubber, mecklenburg schwerin in the German Empire. In his early life, he studied law in Berlin, Kiel, and Rostock, and worked as an attaché in the Foreign Office. He was involved in the Bund Viking Free Corps and then in Adler and Falk, which was a Nazi youth organization before the Hitler Youth was founded. Johann became actively involved in Volkish politics during the Weimar Republic era, before joining the Nazi Party in 1929. He was a district speaker and leader of the National Socialist Students League, and in 1933 he signed their vow of most faithful allegiance to Adolf Hitler. Von Leers supported himself writing freelance articles for the National Socialist Press, and joined their Waffen-SS in 1936 as a sub Sturmbannführer, eventually becoming a full honorary. Around this time he served as a professor at the University of Jena, in Thuringia, Eastern Germany. He was appointed by Joseph Goebbels to work in the propaganda ministry, here he was assigned to disseminate party propaganda, writing 27 books between 1933 and 1945, one of the books he wrote was the anti-Semitic, text, titled, Juden sehen die Kann, or Jews are looking at you, in English. In December 1942, von Leers published an article in Die Juden Fransch, a journal popular in the anti-Semitic intellectual world, entitled, Judaism and Islam as Opposites. As the title implies, it presents Judaism and Islam in terms of similarities and differences. This article also reveals the ingratiating national, socialist perspective which he projected on the Islamic past as well as the intensity of his hatred for Judaism. Von Leers was a proponent of advocating a race-free foreign relations policy on the basis of relationship and alliance. He authored a memo which led to the exemption of non-Jewish racial minorities from race laws in the Third Reich in 1934, 1936, and 1937. After the war ended in 1945, he fled to Italy, where he lived for five years, and then moved to Argentina in 1950, where he continued his propaganda activities. During this period he was a contributor to Der Vege, a Nazi publication founded in Buenos Aires in 1947. He was praised by the Palestinian Arab nationalist Haj Amin al husseini for his loyalty to Arab nationalism. After Argentina, he moved to Egypt. But, Ingtel, who led the Swedish fascist movement, created an escape route for Nazis from Europe, it passed through northern Germany and Denmark, and led to Malmo, in southern Sweden. From there the Nazis were smuggled to various places in southern Sweden and then sent by ship from Gothenburg, in southern Sweden, to South America. In sword he had helped about 4,000 Nazis escape the Pug this route. One of those Perungl assisted was Johann von Leers, who reportedly arrived in Malmo in 1947, and got to Buenos Aires, where he edited a paper that became a communications channel between Nazis in Europe and those who moved to Latin America. Von Leers was later brought to Egypt under the auspices of Hajj Amin al husseini with whom he was in close contact. Eventually he converted to Islam and changed his name to Omar Amin as a gesture to his benefactor, becoming head of Egyptian President Gamal Abdel Nasser's so-called Israeli propaganda unit. He was welcomed in Egypt by al husseini and he became the political advisor to the information department under Muhammad Naguib and Gomal Abdel Nasser. He also served as head of the Institute for the Study of Zionism, Managing, and Israeli Propaganda. He was a mentor of Ahmed Huber, a Swiss-German journalist who was born Albert Huber, and converted to Islam, and networked with Muslim emigres in Hamburg. Johann von Leers died in Cairo, Egypt on March 5, 1965, at the age of 63.